totally cool, all you dudes and dudes let Sammy surf here. We're here at Capo Shores on the beach at San Clemente. We're going to be drawing three totally radical cartoons with me and all of the dudes and dudes out here and Mr. GB. So stay cartoon cool. Get a piece of paper and get your pen We're gonna draw along with one of your friends It could be Sammy or Slowpole Joe Stay cartoon and watch the show Cartoon time It's cartoon time It's simple, it's silly, it's lots of fun We're gonna draw along with everyone Pirate Petey, Mr. Wizard the Wiz It's simple and silly, it's what it is Practice. <laughs> totally cute. Welcome back. Sammy Surf here. We're here at the beach. It is so beautiful. Look at all these dudes and doodle collets. And there's a fish called Wanda. Matter of fact, we're going to draw a fish and her name will be Wanda. We're going to start at the left, draw the lips, go all the way around and draw all of the fins. All you dudes and doodle collets. Good to see Mr. Jeepster out there. And all you dudes and doodle collets. Can everybody say cute? All right, we're going to find the center, go towards the left. We're going to draw step by step and draw an oval for the eye, all you dudes and doodle collets. This is a simple and silly cartoon. Can everybody say radical? All right, good to see everybody out there practicing and practicing. Now we're going to do is we're going to draw some kissy lips. So watch how I do this, just a curved line towards the left of that eye. And everybody say eye. I like to draw cartoons. Radical! It's great to see everybody out there surfing. How many people went surfing this morning? All right, just a few of you. The waves are kind of small, but they're going to pick up. They're going to be about 10 feet when we're all finished. Now let's draw those kissy lips. A curved line at the top and then a curved line at the bottom for a fish called Wanda. Radical! Now we're going to draw the other eye for that perspective. Can everybody say perspective? Radicue, what a great group we have out there. Another curve line. Now remember, this is Sammy Surf's cartoon style, and all you dudes and doodle clets have your own unique cartoon style. Cool. Now we're going to draw the pupils or the eyeballs there on the left side, on both sides. A fish called Wanda, a silly looking fish. All you dudes and doodle clets, how many people like to go fishing out there? That's what I thought. Yee-haw, all right. Slowpoke Joe's out there. How many people have a tropical fish tank at home? That's what I thought. How many people out there have saltwater fish? Keel, do you have a clown fish? That's what I thought. Now let's draw a curve line from the left going towards the right and then stop because we're going to draw the fins. And as you know, the fins come from Finland. Totally keel. All right, here we go with that pectoral fin. Can everybody say pectoral fin? All right, totally cool. From the left, going towards the right, and there you go, all you dudes and dudeclets. Mr. Jeepster, what's your favorite kind of fish? Do you have a favorite fish? Like sushi. A sushi, all right, cool. Let's draw a small line from the left, going towards the right, because we're practicing and practicing our simple and silly cartoon. Radicule. Now let's draw the other pectoral fin from the left going towards the right because we're having so much fun and I have the loudest outfit on the beach, the coolest Sammy Surf outfit. If you like it, raise your hand. Cute. They all like it, all you dudes and doodle collets. Now we're going to draw the top of the fish from the left going towards the right. Now you can make your fish long or short or big or small. Just remember to practice, practice, practice. Remember, the more you practice, the better you will draw. Now on the right, a curved line going on up and then stop. And you can find out a lot about fish. You can go to a pet store. They have books on fish. Go to the library. There are a lot of books about fish. 
you can even go to a bookstore. There are so many books about freshwater fish, tropical fish, flying fish, <laughs> and a fish called Wanda. Now we're gonna draw the tail fin or the caudal fin. Can everybody say caudal fin? Totally cute. Let's draw a curve line at the top and then a curve line towards the bottom. You can make a big fin or a small fin, but we're not finished yet. Totally cute. <laughs> They're having lots of fun out there. The beach looks cool. I'm gonna go surfing when I'm all finished with this show, totally cute. Now we're gonna draw that dorsal fin. Remember, think of the door you open to get to your house. We're gonna draw some upside down U's, starting at the left, going towards the right. Make the first one big and then smaller and smaller and smaller, kind of like the four bears. Remember that story? It wasn't as popular as the three bears or the three little pigs. <laughs> totally cute. Now we're gonna draw the gills behind the eyes, named after Vince Gill. Two curved lines behind the eyes to keep it simple and silly for our fish called Wanda. Ready, cute. Good to see everybody out there surfing and having a great time. Look at the fish cam. There is our flying fish. Mr. Fish, do you like a fish called Wanda? That's what I thought. All right, cute. Now we're gonna draw some polka dots, some circles on the right side, all you dudes and doodlecolettes out there having a good time here on the beach at Capo Shores in San Clemente. Ready, cute. Now we're gonna do is we're gonna add some detail. Can everybody say detail? All right, and sing it and swing it. Let's add some straight lines, three or four. All you dudes and doodlecolettes on the dorsal fin and on that tail fin and on the pectoral fin for a fish called Wanda. Totally radicule. Look at all these talented cartoonists sitting on the beach here at Capo Shores having a simple and silly radicule time. Now let's draw some eyelashes. Three on the left, a one and a two and a three, and then three on the right. Kind of like Lawrence Welk, three plus three is six. All right, all of our mathematicians out there doing a radicule good cartooning job out there. Now we're gonna add some more detail, just a curved line, and then we're gonna add some water. All you dudes and doodle collette starting at the left, going towards the right, a U and then a U and then a U and then a U and then a, well, you know what to do. Totally cute. Mr. Jeepster, hey, how you dude. doing today? You wanna go surf? Hey, hey, all right. That's right, ready, cute. You wanna go surfing after the show? Cool. There's an extra board for me. All right, you're not bored, are you? No, but I, I kinda like to use that one. That's a cool board with the dolphins, dolphins. on it. All right. That's we're drawing a fish called Wanda. That's yeah. right. That'd be cool. Cool. Let's yeah. add some action lines. Can everybody out there say action lines? And then we draw some lumpy, bumpy ocean bottom starting at the left, going towards the right, keeping it simple and silly. And as you know, I always say this the more you practice, the better you draw. All you have to do is practice, practice, practice. Totally cool. Let's draw some seaweed. Do you see the seaweed? All right, totally cute. If you have seen seaweed, is it called sawweed? Seaweed? Sawweed. I just saw some seaweed. It's called sawweed. <laughs> All right. Let's draw some seashells <laughs> by the seashore and some simple and silly circles for the sand. And then we're going to draw some bubbles, lots of detail. All you dudes and doodle collettes out there. And there you go for a fish called Wanda. That's right, Mr. Jeepster. There you go. You can color it in, save it, and send it into the show. We're going to take a break, and then we're going to come back and meet Mr. Rocky. We'll see you in just a few. Totally cute. We'll see you guys later. Cute. Get two. All right. Whoa. Hang ten. Cute. All right. Ready, cute. Woo. Radicule, all you dudes and beautifulettes. Welcome back to It's Cartoon Time here at the beach at Capo Shores in San Clemente. It's me, Sammy Surf. Look at this radical outfit I have. It is so cool. Got it at Rocky's Surf and Sport out there on Del Mar in San Clemente. Hey, Shane, how old are you, dude? Four. Four years old. Do you like watching It's Cartoon Time? Mm -hmm. Could you say Radicule? 
Rocky's kind of shy because he went surfing all day this morning. Now, Rocky, you're the owner of Rocky Surf and Sport. And look at, he decked me out. Look at this cool outfit, the cool shades, this shirt. They have some cool stuff over there. Tell us, what do they have out there at Rocky Surf and Sport? We have skateboards, surfboards, we have boogie boards, we have t-shirts, we have little guys clothing like Shane's here, we have the radicule surf trunks and Hawaiian shirts, Hawaiian shirts are big this year, and we have just about everything you'll need to go in the water with. Totally cool, and you have a lot of cool surfboards out there, tell us about the kinds of surfboards you have. Well, Midget Smith shapes all of our custom surfboards, and we have some Surfboards Hawaii. We have Vardaman surfboards, Spider surfboards, and we have all the custom airbrush boards like Michael Brindley did here that does all the dolphins and does all the neat designs on the bottom and on the top. All right, Rocky and Shane, thank you so much. Go out and visit Rocky's Surf City over there off of Del Mar in San Clemente. It is totally cool. You may see me there, too. I like to buy a lot of surf wax. And towards my right, we have Michael. Michael, how you doing today? Doing good. Thank you. Can you say radicule? Radicule. Now, Michael's another type of artist. I'm a cartoonist, and he does airbrush artwork on surfboards. Why don't you tell us about this dolphin board? This dolphin board is done with an airbrush with a lot of different colors on the foam, and then they fiberglass on top of it. How long does it take you to do an average board? It takes me one to two days, sometimes more. How long does it take to do the rendering or the drawing before you put it down on the surfboard? Probably a couple hours. Totally cool. Tell me about this banana board. This banana board is just done uh, with masking it off and then you spray the color and then you put the resin on top of it. And on the back of the board it is peeling and towards the back of me we have the one, the only, who is this? That's Prince Neptune. Prince Neptune. Now can you surf on these boards? Yes you can. But a lot of people just hang them up in their houses don't they? Yes they do. Alright I know you're gonna go surfing. Michael thank you so much and Rocky and Shane thank you so much. All you dudes and doodle some really talented folks out here at Capo Shores and in just a momento we're gonna take a peek at those creative cartoons that they've been cartooning out there, so stay cartooned. Radicule! City, Rocky Surf City, shirts and shorts and cool, cool boards. Rocky Surf, Rocky Surf City. Radicule, creative cartooning kids. All right. Creative. All right. Let's take a peek at the cartoons that they've been drawn out here on the beach. What is your name? Annie. Annie, what a cool cartoon. How old are you? Eight. Eight years old, so you just ate. What did you eat? <laughs> I'm just kidding. She's doing a great job. And dude, what is your name? Hold up that cartoon. Show everybody out there. Aww. Cody. Cody, and how old are you? Seven. Seven years old. Can you say radicule? Radicule. All right, doing a great job out there. Let's see, and what is your name, Doodle Glett? Ashley. Ashley, and how old are you? Ten. Do you like to draw simple and silly cartoons? Mm -hmm. Can you say radicule? Uh, radicule. All right, a, a cool California shirt. And hey, Doodle Colette, what's your name? Heather. All right, and look at that cool cartoon of a fish Heather. called Wanda. What's your favorite kind of fish? Tropical. Tropical fish, oh! that's what I thought. And how old are you? Ten. All right, radicule. Let's go way over here. Lauren, how old are you? Six and a half, and look at that cool cartoon. Is that radicule? What is your favorite kind of fish? A goldfish. All right, they're made out of gold. Let's walk over here. We have a lot of other cool cartoonists out there. Look at this cool cartoon. What is your name? Nicole. Nicole, and how old are you, Nicole? Seven. Seven years old. Look at that cool cartoon. What is your favorite kind of fish? A tropical fish. Tropical fish. There you go, doing a great job. And look at this dude has an official surf cap on. What is your name, dude? All right, and how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. What is your favorite kind of fish? <laughs> Somebody blew their nose. Oh, it's one of those uh, fish out there. I'm not sure what my favorite fish is. You're not sure, but you knows what I'm talking about. There you go. You can hold on to your cartoon. Let's go way over here. All right, look at all these cool cartoonists out there doing a great job. All right, on the beach. Dude, you have a cool surf cap on. What is your name? Aaron. All right, and how old are you? and a half. Can you look up in the sky so everybody can see that nice big smile? What is your favorite kind of fish? A catfish. Catfish. I've seen a dogfish after the catfish. That is so cool. And we have some more cool cartoonists out there. What is your name, dude? John. 
John, how old are you? Ten and a half. Ten and a half, and what do you like to do at the beach? Um, surf. Surf, can you say totally cool? Totally cool. All right, there you go. And we have one more cartoon to take a peek at. What is your name? Jake. Jake, what do you like to do at the beach? Surf. Surf, totally cool. And how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. Can you hang ten? Hang ten. Totally cute. All right, thank you so much. If you want to be on It's Cartoon Time or if you want to send in a cartoon, here's all you have to do. Mr. Jeepster, take yeah. it away. It's Cartoon Time, B.O. Box 3 at 104, San Clemente, California. 9267431104, send your cartoons in. It's Cartoon Time, B.O. Box 3 at 104, San Clemente, California. 9267431104, send your cartoons in. All right, totally cool. It is such a windy day here at the beach. I know this paper is going to be blowing everywhere, all you dudes and doodacolettes out there. We're going to be drawing Billy the Silly Seahorse. So get another piece of paper and a pen or a pencil, and we're going to draw step by step, all you dudes and doodacolettes out there. So what we're going to do is we're going to get our pen, and what we're going to do is we're going to start at the top, and we're going to work our way down. Can everybody say kill? All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to start at the top, and then we're going to go down, 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 down under. Not to Australia, though. Starting at the top, we're going to draw a circle for the eye. All in favor, say aye. Opposed? OK, the eyes have it. Look at all these cool cartoonists out there. Totally cute. Now we're going to draw the nose, the schnozzola, a curved line from the left going towards the right for the mouth of this Billy the Silly Seahorse. How many people have seen a silly seahorse before? Raise your hand. That's what I thought. Now we're going to draw the other eye for that perspective. Can everybody say perspective? Perspective. All right, totally cool. A lot of audience participation out there. Doing a great job. Can everybody say kill? All right, you should be wide awake because this is the loudest outfit I've ever seen. Now we're going to do is we're going to draw the pupils in the eyes on the left on both sides. All you dudes and doodacolettes out there doing a radical cartoon and good job Cowabunga. out there. That's right, Cowabunga, dude. Radical. Now let's draw the bottom. Draw the jaw from the left going towards the right. All you dudes and doodacolettes out there. Radical. Good to see everybody practicing and practicing. Look at all these cartoonists wearing their surf shorts and their sandals and their surf caps. Radical. Now let's draw Sammy's surf hat from the left, going towards the right, and then a curve line on the right and a curve line on the left. All you dudes and doodacolettes. And when I'm done with this cartoon, I'm going to run over and get some surf wax at, at Rocky's Surf City. Totally cool. With shirts and shorts and cool, cool bars, it's Rockies. Oh, Thank sorry, you so I, much. I just had to. Kill! All right, let's draw a curve line from the left, going towards the right, keeping it simple and silly. All you dudes and doodacolettes out there, I am so impressed because we're drawing Billy the Silly Seahorse. All right, here we go. We're going to draw the neck on the left and then a straight back for the back. And look at that. We're going to try to make it through this cartoon because. That tsunami's rolling in, the winds are picking up, the waves are going to be over 10 feet, they're going to be breaking over the rocks over here, so we're going to have to keep cartooning. Thank you so much, Kill. Let's draw the big belly from the left, going on down. Seahorses have big bellies because they like to eat a lot of plankton and a lot of seaweed, all you dudes and do to coolettes out there. All right, here we go, we're going to draw a curve line going all the way around from the left, going back towards the right, and then we're going to connect for Billy the silly seahorse here at Capo Shores in San Clemente. All you dudes and doodacolettes, raise your hand. You'd rather be surfing right now. I would too out there, but let's finish this cartoon because cartoons are so much fun. All right, let's draw the fins towards the back. A U and then 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 a U. Well, you know what to do. All you dudes and doodacolettes out there. Hey, dude, how you doing? You want to get a Sammy Surf Burger later? Yeah, does that have guacamole on it? Guacamole, cute. totally cute. All right, let's draw the fin on this side, a curved line from the left towards the right, and then a line connecting. This is difficult, but if you practice, 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 you'll know what to do. Totally cute. Good to see everybody out there. Seahorses like to hang out towards the bottom of the ocean, hanging onto that seaweed. Now let's draw some curved lines, starting at the top, going all the way down towards 
the right. All you dudes and dudes out there. Look at that, what a talented group we have. And now we're gonna draw some scales. Draw the scales. Starting towards the right, going all the way down. Draw some U's because you know what to do out there. Totally cute. Can everybody say that? Key. All right. Now let's draw a curve line at the top. Lines going in different directions because you're doing a real simple and silly radicule job out there. Remember, simple and silly and practice, practice, practice. That's right, Mr. Jeepster, good to see you. Nice Do you want to make a too. smoothie later too? I love smoothies. All right, they're yeah. smooth. Like the surf is cool. <laughs> All right. All right, let's draw some shade. You remember that song? Shading, shade. Oh boy, let's draw the nostrils now. On the left and then on the right, Italian four nostroli, a little bit of Parmesan cheese, meatballs on the side. Oh yes, oh nostroli, all right. Now let's draw some water from the left going towards the right because we are at the beach and all of these cartoons have a lot of water. H2O. Let's draw that seaweed wiggling on up towards the left. That's right. Cowabunga, all you radicule. And doodle coulettes out there. The seahorse in the seaweed. Totally, totally radicule. And there you go for Billy the Silly. Horse. I hope you had a lot of fun. If you had fun, say I had fun. Totally cool. Hey, all you dudes and doodle clips, hold up your cartoons. Show Cartoon Man over there. Show the surf guy. Look at these cool cartoons out there. Practicing and practicing. Look at that. Billy the Silly Seahorse. We'll be right back after this message because they're going to practice, practice, practice. Radicule. All right. Sammy Surf. He's a surfer. Sammy Surf. He's a surfer and he's cool. Oh man, he grew. Well, Sammy Surf. Cartooning kids. Radicule, welcome back to It's Cartoon Time. It's me, Sammy Surf. We're here at the beach. Nathan, how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. Look at this great cartoon that you draw. Can you say Radicule? Radicule. All right. Thank you so much. And what is your name? Aaron. Aaron, how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. Did you like drawing Billy the Silly Seahorse? Mm-hmm. All right. And what is your name? Carolina. Carolina. And how old are you? Twelve. Twelve years old. What do you like to do at the beach? Swim. Swim. You did a great job on your cartoon. And dude, what's your name? Colin. Colin. And how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. You like drawing simple and silly cartoons? Hold that up so everybody can see. Aww. Say radicule. Radicule. Thank you so much. And hey, Doodle Colette, what's your name? Carla. Carla. How old are you? Nine. Nine years old. And what do you like to do at the beach? I like to surf. You like to surf. I bet you're a great surfer. All right, Doodle Colette, what is your name? April. April. How old are you? 10. 10 years old, and do you like to practice, practice, practice? Yes. All right, thank you so much. And our last cartoonist, what is your name? Caroline. All right, Caroline, and how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. Who is your favorite It's Cartoon Time character? Do you have one? No. Do you like Sammy Sir? Yes. That's me, good answer. Thank you so much, these great cartoonists out there. Go find a seat. We're going to draw one more cartoon, a quick draw. But before we do that, if you want to see your cartoon on It's Cartoon Time, here's where you send it in. Yeah. It's Cartoon Time, P.O. Box 3104, San Clemente, California. 9267431104, send your cartoons in. Thanks, Jeepster. All right, radicule. All right, we're going to do a quick draw now. Are you ready? We're going to draw a hot diggity dogger because I have to go surfing. But here we go. We're going to start at the top. We're going to work our way down. We're going to draw a surfboarder, a hot dog and surfboarder. Here we go on the left and on the right. Draw the eyes towards the top. We're going to draw a hot dog, a hot diggity dogger. Then we're going to make a curve line from the left going towards the right. All you dudes and doodle that's our third and final cartoon. That's right. Let's draw a surf hat from the left towards the right and a curve line on the left and a curve line on the right and then an upside down U because you know what to do all you dudes and doodle Colette. Now let's draw the nose and a nice big open mouth and then draw some shading. Make the eyes looking off towards the right and let's make the arms and the hands and the fingers. I know I'm drawing fast but I know you can do it if you practice. Practice, 
practice on the left and then on the right. And there's the surfboard. Surfing on a, a short rocky surfboard from Rocky Surf City off of Del Mar there. Some mustard and there you go on the left and on the right. Dudes and Doodleglets, thank you so much for watching me. Sammy Surf here at the beach on It's Cartoon Time. See if you can draw that. I knew I drew that in about 45 seconds, but I know you can do it. Remember we drew three cartoons? A fish called Wanda was our first one, and then Billy the Silly Seahorse, and then our fast cartoon of Hot Diggity Dogger. We're here at Capo Shores having so much fun. I'm gonna go surfing. Dudes and Doodleglets, thank you so much for watching It's Cartoon Time. Mr. Jeepster, let me shake your hand. You did thank a rather cool job you out too, there. Sammy. Nice outfit. Totally cool. Did you yeah. have fun? You want to hang ten, do some tandem surfing? You mean I could surf with you? You sure can. <laughs> totally cool. Dudes and Doodleglets, stand on up, everybody, because we're going to have a beach party here. We're going to do some dancing. We'll see you later. Totally cool. Rather cool. All right. <laughs> Practice, practice, practice. Cowabunga.